Right there, right there. Staff Sergeant Brandon Ward has met the enemy many times in his Army career, so he knows what it takes to be the bad guy. My first deployment, I deployed with 3-7 Cav, and we were in Baghdad. My second deployment was in Ramadi in 2007. My third deployment, I was in Kirkuk with 137 out of Fort Bliss um, in 2010. And then my last one, I was with 130th Infantry, went to Afghanistan in 2011. Ward is a member of the 11th Armored Cavalry, the Black Horse Regiment, recognized as one of the toughest op fours opposing forces in the Army's keep annals. Going, keep going, right there. What I demand of every one of our Black Horse soldiers is they are out to win. My desire of them is they are given their toughest fight that they can give to the rotational training unit. The battleground for the 11th Cav is Fort Irwin's National Training Center, 1,200 miles of Mojave Desert, committed to making RTUs, rotational training forces, better fighters. The 11th ACR has been the opposing force here at NTC since 1994. It's a role that they fill with great enthusiasm and dedication. The opposing force gets a vote. When do I attack? What are my objectives? What am I trying to achieve? In this fight, the RTU looks to enter and seize a village occupied by the Op 4, cast as armed insurgents. Within the Black Horse Regiment, almost all of the unit has spent time in combat. You know, people who have been to Iraq or Afghanistan kind of know what they've seen, what the insurgents actually use, so we can kind of take that now, use it against the, the guys and get them some good training. Training that brings to the front scenarios crafted to make today's soldiers smarter, sharper, able to move forward in the face of the enemy. Gail McCabe, Fort Irwin.